Cancer, this is Jackie Tom. This is your general reading for the week of August 8, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. If you're seeking a personal reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. Okay, Cancer, a couple signs that may resonate with you guys this week. Sagittarius and a Taurus. Now, this is going to be a strong week in love for you guys. Uh, could be date night or some kind of special outing or get together coming up. Secrets will be revealed this week as you move forward. And let me say this, there's some new money and new opportunities. But what at first seems like a disappointment will actually turn out to be a blessing in disguise. So, birth card up. Cancer, you got the tower. Tower card moment, nothing to fear, okay? Uh, but it is um, your temper, okay? And we'll go further with this message. It's going to be very sudden, very brief and passing. Uh, it could be someone that's made you mad, that you vent about it, and then you move forward. But we'll see. Like I said, we'll clarify that. Nine of Pentacles coming in as a financial independence. <laughs> So things going well there on the financial front of things. May have a little extra to spend. Now we have the moon. And I swear I've had the moon in every reading so far. The moon indicates divine timing. And what I mean by divine timing, it means things have to line up and fall into place before the next event can occur. So dig for your patience because no matter wishing, wanting, or fairy dust is going to make things move any quicker. Okay, and then with that, we have the Two of Swords. Two of Swords says, you guys have got decisions that you've been putting off for too long. And to be quite honest with you, you're looking a little bit wishy-washy here. So you need to take time to make these decisions and get this out of your way because it's kind of pulling on your energy. Center of the reading, we have the Empress, the Mother card, okay? That Mother card shows positive changes on the home front. You could also, for a small percentage of you, get be getting the news of a pregnancy. Moving forward, you guys have the Hermit. The Hermit, I love. The Hermit says no matter what, you're on the right path, even if you don't feel that you are. Now, granted, it is a, a path less traveled, but it does show that you are absolutely on the right path. And we have judgment. Ooh, be warned of gossip. Okay. Be warned of gossip. Don't buy into it. And also, be careful who you pass judgment on because you're going to be wrong. Okay. Remember that the next few days. And we have the wheel. We've got a lot of major arcanas going on here. The wheel is now turning into your favor. Uh, bringing in good luck and abundance. And for some of you, this could indicate some kind of partnership, whether it's in business or whether it's personal. Uh, but yeah, some kind of partnership. And we have the Page of Cups coming in with an unexpected offer of love and throwing out there a Pisces energy. Now, let's see. Major Arcanas. We have the Tower, the Moon, the Empress, the Hermit, Judgment, the Wheel, We've got quite a few here, so let's clarify these, go further with these messages for my cancers. This is still your week of August 8th, 2022. Very high vibration, and very high energy, okay? Almost like electrical shock from what I'm seeing. On the tower, you have a spiritual blessing as well as a financial blessing. So perhaps the argument may be about money. Could also be a mechanical breakdown. With that on the Nine of Pentacles, we have the Nine of Wands. This is that majiggity card. It means you're going to feel like a cat on a hot tin roof. Like I said, that electrical shock. This says you're going to be anxious, excited, and overwhelmed. You're going to feel all of that all rolled into one. It's going to be completely normal. On the moon card, be warned, there's threes a crowd, okay? Threes a crowd. Third person, I want advice and or opinions. Bottom line, cancer, someone's trying to stick their nose in your business. On the two of swords, we have the new beginning is in the love life, okay? And on the Empress card, there it is. There's the hermit beside the hermit. Can't make that up. You guys are on the right path no matter what you're doing, okay? And on the original hermit, we have the King of Swords. Now, some of you may be dealing with someone that has kind of a sharp tongue who may kind of beat up or lash out at you, but they're doing so from a good place, so it's nothing negative. And I also want to throw out there that a Libra may or may not resonate. 
on the judgment card. Again, the moon has come in. It is driving home to dig for your patience. Okay, it is all about divine timing. So this does indicate that you're going to have a little bit of a patience problem this week. Okay, the wheel that good luck and abundance comes with just that. Total happiness, total contentment, and those love errors flying around. With that page of cups going again with the two of cups, there are decisions to make that you've been putting off. And the center of the reading, we have the world, as in the world is your oyster. So, Cancer, I mean, you've got some things to address here. There's someone in your business. There's decisions to be made that you've been putting off. Yes, there's going to be some kind of mechanical breakdown. Might be like a money mess up in the bank, something like that. But overall, you're dealing with some extremely high energy and good luck and abundance. So, enjoy. Now, uh, JackieTomlin.com, if you're seeking a personal reading, you guys have a fantastic week. I will see you soon. Bye.